Well, the tension is palpable as this fight gets underway, and it's going to be interesting to see how this matchup plays out. Definite striker on one side against another guy who can really do it all. And in those situations, normally the... Oh! She's done! He's done! Big knee lands there. Oh, nice right hand. Just misses with the straight right. Well, we talked about his reach advantage off the top. Made good use of it there with that punch, DC. Just out of range with that right hand. Much improved defensively as he blocks the shot. Oh! Huge right hand! He's in trouble. He's hurt bad. Oh, oh he might be out. Going back to that jab, keeps throwing that jab, but unable to land. It's okay. Just out of range with the big right hand. Nice punch by Amir Khani. Now going upstairs with the left hook. And follows up with another one. He's got to flip his hip into that kick. Well, that body kick was there earlier, not there on that attempt. Yeah. Under three minutes now to go on the round. Try to establish that jab. Checks that leg kick. And he connects with a punch there. We'll see if there's more where that came from. Boxing, boxing, boxing. Continues to use his jab effectively here, DC. He gets that hand to the target pretty quick. I mean, just right away, blasting the jab after jab after jab. He's a phenomenal boxer with a vast understanding of fighting behind that educated jab. That is as big a strike as he has landed thus far tonight. Big, massive shot lands. Look at how tough his opponent is, though. Still standing, still in their fight. Oh! What a fantastic strike to throw at the exact right moment. He deserves this moment. Go finish this fight. Oh, straight right. Oh, a huge block there. Boom. Big jab. Well, you see him land the jab there. He's got the reach advantage. You might as well use it. Effective punch there by Amir Khan. Whips on the straight right hand. Kick home, and now his opponent in a world of trouble. Such a sneaky head kick. He did not recognize it was coming high, and now he's got him hurt bad. Get right here. Oh, Superman punch is good. You can tell he's been working on that. All right, so he continues to land that jab. His opponent said he was ready for it, but doesn't appear to. You're not ready until you're in there. You can watch all the film you want. You can spar as much as you want, but until you feel a guy with a fast jab like this, you don't understand the precision of that punch. And he landed the right hand there. Swing and a miss by the Korean Super. His opponent in a world of trouble. Beautiful level change. Make him think you're going low and come right over the top with that beautiful overhand. Great punch. Big punch lands over the top. 
How is he going to follow this one up? Oh, man, I'm, I'm just so glad that front kick didn't hit me. It kind of felt like it did. Right in the sternum. Your opponent comes forward and drive the ball of your foot into your opponent's sternum in hopes to really affect the breathing. The striking game isn't looking too sharp right now. Let's play the grappling game. you got to protect yourself. Your hands high. All right, so let us now check out some of the action in that round, DC. There was a whole lot of it, including a stunner upstairs that nearly closed the show. It was a lot of action. It was back and forth action, but the big moment was that big strike to the head that landed that put him on wobbly legs and in survival mode. Luckily, he made it to the end of that round. Okay, ready? Round two. You ready? Round two is on the way. Nice hook lands. Oh! Big ball punch lands. Now he gets back to range. Lands flush with that right hand. Continues to mix it up, going to the head, mixing in some body shots. Amir Khani's lower jaw now starting to show signs of swelling. Trying to establish that jab once again. Look at the whip action that comes from him throwing that kick. And a nice left hand there on the inside. Amir Khan gets caught with that punch. Not the easiest guy in the world to hit, but he got caught there. So he's really starting to put together some significant body shots here. These are gonna take their... You don't really stand. After you take a head kick like this, that is such toughness to even be on his feet right now. Knee to the body. Oh, big left. Well, he's got the kicking game going tonight. Lands another one there. A beautiful kick, and all I can think of, better him than me. Just missed with the left there. He's landed some good shots tonight, but this is not a combo meal, right? No three-piece, no soda. It's one and done more often than not. John, don't you come to me without a combo. I want the whole platter. Give him the whole platter, young man. Put some punches together. Make this guy take the whole thing. Give him more than one strike. You have now found a set of punch. The jab is landing consistently. Find something that's going to go behind it. Oh! Just out of the range with that right hand. Still nice body kick lands. Oh, that's a nice strike. And he comes through with a big knee. <laughs> Unable to connect with the right. Really timing his shots nicely. Good tempo, very accurate, finding the range with relative ease. Yeah, he's doing a great job of really overwhelming his opponent with activity. All right, he engages in a single collar tie here. Oh, big knee! Close guard. All right, so inside the open guard of his opponent. You gotta be careful playing around for too long here on the ground with this guy. A lot of top pressure being applied here as he works out of side control. Oh, man, this ground and pound is good. Probably my favorite striking realm in MMA, and he's as good as it gets. The problem is his opponent is not controlling his posture. He's allowing his opponent to get a over. You knew if he landed that weapon repeatedly, it could be a short night for his opponent, but that was just one perfectly placed strike that his opponent candidly didn't even see coming. It landed flush, and the rest, as they 
say is history. Big knockout win for him here tonight. So there he is as the celebration continues. A huge knockout.